Right, hiya, it's Glenn again from Doncaster College. You've probably seen me on most of the videos in this place, but here I am again, obviously quite enjoy it. Anyway, we're back in painting and decorating again, and we're just going to show you a few little things that we do. And obviously you can see the students around getting their areas ready for, uh, for testing uh, within painting and decorating, but we've got one student here, Alex, who's doing a little bit of specialist effect work. Uh, we're trying to simulate oak oak grains. Now Alex is using a number of methods here uh, and we've applied the oak over the top of, of the base coat which was this creamy colour and we're trying to simulate the natural pore markings on it. Now if you're going down here with a flogger as you can see very very gently just trying to get rid of all the brush marks as you can see on here and trying to simulate that a little bit. Now if you're doing it very very gently or you can do it a little bit more harsh if you will Alex please. Um, it's quite a, a painstaking piece of work, but it's something you have to be very, very patient at and you have just got to keep going at it. There's two ways of doing it. There's one with the flogger, as she's showing, and Alex, if you could just show us with the, uh, with the other tool, please. This one's called a rocker. Now, this is a piece of rubber which simulates uh, a little bit of an oak grain or a knot in oak. And Alex is just going to demonstrate how we use this now. So, when you place it on, and you run it down the side by twisting it and that gives you the knot that you can actually see just there and you just watch it, so you're going to go all the way to the end because it needs to be a continuous piece well done and then she would maybe just soften some of these up using the badger softener and just try to just soften them a little just to take away that starkness of the lines. That's it. But as you can see, it's very, very painstaking. Uh, very, you have to be very, very patient. And you can just see that the, the the difference that she's making towards that bit of grain. It just looks that little bit more natural. There's no two pieces that are exactly the same within this. So there's no real right and wrong. <laughs> 